Ah, the sound of Minecraft music. Hello everybody and welcome to my new hardcore series. Before we jump straight into episode 1 and get going with gameplay, there's a few ground rules I need to lay out. First and foremost, remember that I have never done this before. I've never played hardcore Minecraft in my life. Secondly, there's a very specific way I want to play the game here. When I play Minecraft, I want to build a nice house, I have a nice base, I get everything fully enchanted and fully set up, and then I beat the game, and then I just enjoy the game, right? With this series, I want to beat the game as quickly as possible, but I do not want to speedrun it. I still want to have a base, I still want to get good gear, but I don't want to spend ages doing it. I want to beat the game in a quick and concise manner. I don't want to speedrun it, but I also don't want to spend ages doing it. And those are the two things to remember. This is not a speedrun, but I'm still doing it in a relatively quick way. With that being said, let's get into making the world. I just want to do this so that you guys can see. There's no cheats or anything like that. World type default, I'm not going to make any seeds or anything. Experiments. I'm playing on the lightest snapshot. Um, this is all a new thing for me. And uh, no bonus chests because I'm not a pussy. Let's go! As many of you will know, I do like to keep my videos relatively concise, relatively short and sweet. So I'm not going to have this drag on for too long. And uh, I will try and get things done as quickly as possible. And, you know, not have the video go on for ages. You gotta be kidding me. You are joking me. The worst spawn I could have ever imagined in my life. What the f- oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I got a little bit of wood, we're gonna go plop. We're gonna- I did not mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that, and then I can do that. And then I can do that. Okay, we're gonna do that, and um, we're gonna do that. I don't know how long this series is going to be. Obviously, being hardcore, it is a permadeath. Um, and in Minecraft, I am notoriously clumsy. But I wouldn't say I die a lot. We're going to have trouble in the nether, I think. Because the nether terrifies me. So, uh... Yeah. What I'm really not happy about is this spawn. It could have been so much better, and it is so unbelievably underwhelming and wet. It's a it's a wasteland. It's a it's a complete wasteland. It's all snow and ice. I feel like I'm in a, I feel like I'm in an ice age. There has got to be something somewhere. There has got to be. You know what? I am a very um. I guess backwards thinking person is the way to say it. No, it's not the way to say it. Uh, what I'm trying to say is... If this seed just keeps going like this for... I mean, you know, I've travelled a fair few blocks. If this seed just keeps going like this forever... I mean, what biome even is this? Some sort of snowy, snowy beach? What, I mean, what... If it just keeps going like this, I might just kill myself. You know, should we play with... Oh. I was gonna ask, should we play with fire and hit him? Um, I didn't actually know that polar bears were hostile. They're hostile. That could have been an, an end that I didn't plan for, and a really quite abrupt one as well. You know what, I am so unbelievably autistic that I have such a short attention span and something that seems like a great idea that I'm highly motivated for. That can really change up really quite quickly. I'm looking at this drop here, and I'm thinking about it. You know, maybe, maybe if this is something that you all want to see in the future, I might, I might try it. But um, yeah, I'm I'm getting cold feet. Literally, I've been walking on ice for about three hours. So uh, oh no, whoopsie daisy, I am a silly goose. <laughs> 